How much do you like working at the position and having the role you now have with the defense kind of switching things up some? I love it. You get to mess with the quarterback a little bit, rushing and going, kind of change it up a little bit. You feel like it plays to your strengths as a player? Definitely. It, get, it gets the linebackers a little bit more versatile, able to drop back, rush, kind of just play at the quarterback head a little bit. Is there a lot of learning going on for you guys, or are you guys having to learn new responsibilities with this, this change? Definitely a lot of learning. It's, yeah. it's also better for me because I get to learn from Leonard and other older players ahead of me, so I love it. What makes you a fit for that position? Uh, well, we ran in, I ran this in high school, so I get a little bit more, kind of more leeway, kind of can run, rush. I love it, dropping back. I did a lot of that in the offseason with Sante, doing a lot of DB, DB drills, so. It's a little bit. It's a little bit better. Have you had to bulk up at all to adjust to that new role? Yeah, I'm still bulking up actually. So, the more weight you have during the season, you're gonna lose all that weight. So the more weight you have, the better. Do you have like a target weight in mind at all, or is it? Uh, well, I'm trying to get to like 230 oh, wow, just for, woo, just for the draft. But for the season, probably like 220. Did you drop a lot in coverage in high school? Yeah, well, they lo they like me going a lot, but I also dropped a little bit. Okay. I didn't drop much. So. Have you dropped more in here at FSU as far as uh, versus high school? And what's the biggest transition in play uh, playing against the pass? Um, well, I dropped a lot in high school and also worked on it a lot with the DBs, kind okay. of DB drills, and also in the spring when I played start. So it's kind of the same for me. Is this defense more designed for, for like the defensive lineman to take on things to open up plays for you guys, or are you guys having to go make plays yourself? Oh, uh, well, as you can see, we have a pretty solid D line. So the D line makes plays for us to free us up, and the D line gonna make plays just just because they savages. So regardless, we only see a small portion of the practice, but we see some different things that you guys are doing just in terms of like the drills and stuff. Is, is that stuff you guys are doing last year, or is there a lot of new sort of emphasis placed on certain drills uh, kind of being installed? Oh uh, yeah, we have a new emphasis on like using our hands, kind of you see how I was doing the back drills, just kind of using our hands more and just getting off blocks. Ultimately, the goal is to create a pass rush. Mm -hmm. Life's different without Brian Burns and such, and the scheme's different. Do you guys feel like from a results standpoint a few days in, that you see it generating the pass rush you hope would come from the adjustment? Definitely, because a lot of the drills we work kind of shows up a lot in the team and the other sessions we do. So it, I kind of like working on the pass rush and also the dropping back. So it's just good to work on all that. Is it a new thing working with Coach? Was Coach Snyder coaching you guys up last season at all? Or, or, or are you working with him more closely this, this year? Around? Yeah, I'm working with him more closely. I was with uh, Coach Woody last year. So with Coach Snyder being more of an outside linebacker kind of guy, able to work with me on kind of just different, kind of just playing football more and not thinking. You think this scheme is a better fit for your skill set? Yeah, I love it. I love it. <laughs> Thanks, Mark.